What's going on, bodybuilding and figure fans? Mike Chad here at the uh, beginning of the pre-judging here at the NBA Columbia Classic. Katie's going all out and getting some quality awards for her competitors, some good goodie bags. Uh, so we're to get underway. We'll get underway. Talking to Chadwick Austin here. Chadwick just placed in the top five in the IFPA Pro Bowl. And the IFPA Pro USA is coming up in the next three weeks. So, Chad, what's your prep looking like uh, coming into the Pro USA? Pretty good. I feel pretty good. Um, you know, after the top five, uh, this show, the uh, IPA Pro USA, wasn't on my radar. But you know, after coming in good at the last show, I figured why not uh, keep it going. You yeah. know, so I feel pretty good about my prep. Oh, so you kind of changed your plan. Your plan was a Pro Bowl. You're just gonna play it by ear, say you did there, and then make up your mind after that, huh? Yeah, yeah. Basically, that was it. Okay, gotcha. So were you, now there was a uh, there were a lot of quality competitors at the Pro Bowl, so to get in the top five at a show like that, that's probably you know one of your better outings. Uh, any talk after the show? Because I know there's some competitors that thought they should have ended up in the top five, but it ended up being your day. Could have went a lot of different ways. There were like three or four of you battling for that fifth place spot. Uh, what was the what was going on after the show as far as what the competitors were talking about as to whether they should have ended up in fifth place or not? Well, there were a few competitors, obviously, you know, at the end of every show that's, you know, pretty much the case where you think you should have been a little bit better than you, you were. So there were a few that thought they should have been in the top five, but, um, you know, I guess it was just my day. So Yeah, well, every dog has his day, and on that day it was Chadwick Austin's. And you know what? Every single show there's going to be somebody that feels they should have placed higher. Uh, I think every single show there's always somebody that gets a gift, and there's always somebody that gets robbed. And, uh, you know, somebody's always going to be upset, but it's subjective. That's the kind of sport we're in, and that's just how it goes. But under bigger and better things, IFPA Pro USA, that's one of the biggest shows out there, I think. I mean, next to the Orton Cup and the Gaspari Pro, I'm thinking the USA is probably the third biggest show in the IFPA. So if you do well at a show like that, uh, that's going to mean some big things for you so I guess the plan is obviously to qualify for the Orton Cup is that what's on your radar well I already qualified um, via the, the Pro Bowl uh, top five there but you know at this show I just want to see if I can get another top five finish I mean, that's pretty much it. Yeah, if you can get a top five finish at a show like the IFPA Pre USA, it's probably a pretty good indicator that you'll do well at the Orton Cup also. Uh, what kind of changes have you made since the Pro Bowl? Uh, like what kind of improvements do you think you need to make from the Pro Bowl to the USA? I just need to be fuller. I just need to be fuller. I came in very flat and depleted, uh, you know, trying to get that conditioning factor yeah. in there. And it didn't work out the way I planned. Some people thought it was a good look, but I didn't like it. So I'm just going to try to come in fuller. Yeah. Okay. You know. How's your weight now compared to the uh, Pro Bowl? I'm up about five pounds. Okay. Just so you are filled fuller. out. Just fuller. Okay. You know, so about five pounds up. Good stuff. Was well, there anything the judges said after the Pro Bowl that you need to improve on to get to the upper echelon, like the top three of the top pro shows? I I'm I'm bottom heavy. Yeah. You know, my, my so my symmetry, you know, to come in better, I just need to fill out my chest and my shoulders. Okay. You know, so if I could bring that in a little bit better, and that's what I'm trying to do with coming in fuller. Yeah. You know, so hopefully uh, the look will be good enough to get okay. the nod. Bottom heavy by meaning your legs are bigger but not as conditioned or your legs are like your best body part? They're my best body part. Okay, well, I always say legs win shows. <laughs> if you're going to have one body part that's ahead of everything else, it's not a bad one to have thighs be that body part because, yeah, legs do win shows. That's for damn sure. Okay, well, sounds good. And uh, what about your – have you done anything with your diet differently to bring you into the USA more fuller, jump your carbs? What would you do? I've I've actually upped my protein. Yeah. And that's that's all I've done. I've upped my protein and that's allowed me to fill out a little bit more and um I'm just going to ride that out into the show. Gotcha. You do your own diet or somebody do it for you? I do my own. Okay. What's your? Because a lot of people like using the prep coaches and that, but, I mean, you know your body best, so what's your take on that? You just want to – if you do it yourself, then you know what you're doing. You know your body better than anybody else, and that's the way to go? Well, normally when you get a, with a, a coach, you're going to go through a period where they have to learn your body. Sure. So why not learn your own body yeah. and go from there, yeah. you know? So it, just like you said, you know your body better than anybody else. So versus having somebody else – come in and tell me what I need to do. I just, you know, learn nutrition, figure out what works for me and go from there. Gotcha. Okay. Well, it's Chadwick's first time into the Seattle area. I've been here once before, but I never got to explore before. So I think after the show and tomorrow during the day, we're going to go exploring some Seattle a little bit. But we got a big show ahead of us today. I'm going to keep you guys updated on the latest here at the Columbia Classic. Got a lot of top amateurs coming your way. Look for my videos on YouTube. Just type in Inside Natural Bodybuilding on Facebook. You'll see all the videos and the latest in natural bodybuilding. Until next time, bodybuilding and figure fans, this is Chadwick Austin, top IFPA pro. Look for him at the USA. This is Mike Newman. You're watching Inside Natural Bodybuilding here at the Natural Columbia Classic. We're out of here. Thanks for watching.